Good, Good morning, morning Chargers. Chargers! This is Nikita and Sophia. Welcome back to another day of WRSN. In today's show, we'll be celebrating the beginning of Hispanic Heritage Month and meet some of Suncoast's new teachers. Let's get right into it. Today, students dressed up in green and gold to support our football team who has a home game against Jupiter tonight at 6.30. Let's take a look at what our students are wearing. Thank you guys for showing your spirit. Today is the beginning of Hispanic Heritage Month. Let's go to a video made by Hands Across Campus honoring some notable figures in Hispanic culture. Hello everyone. On behalf of Hands Across Campus, we will be celebrating Hispanic Heritage Month by honoring some notable Hispanic people. Um, and as a reminder, Hispanic Heritage Month starts on September 15th, this Thursday, and lasts until October 15th. So to start off, we have Julia Alvarez. She was born to Dominican parents, and she went on to become one of the most critically revered Latino writers and has published poems, novels, and essays throughout her career. Next, we have Julian Castro. He's an American lawyer and politician of Mexican descent. He was the youngest member of President Obama's cabinet, serving as the 16th United States Secretary of Housing and Urban Development. And finally, we have Dolores Huerta. Um, she is an American labor leader and civil rights activist who continues to work tirelessly developing leaders and advocating for the working, poor women and children. And that is all for now. To continue our celebrations on Hispanic Heritage Month, you can join Hands Across Campus this Thursday in room 200 during lunch. Thank you. Thank you, Hands Across Campus. Remember to join them in Ms. Rashid's room 200 during lunch to celebrate Hispanic Heritage Month. Speaking of cultural celebration, Latin Dance is meeting today in Mr. Har's room 310 after school from 315 to 430. Come and learn about Latin music, dance, and culture. All are welcome with no experience needed. Speaking of no experience needed, if you're interested in playing tabletop games such as Dungeons and Dragons and Warhammer, join the Tabletop RPG Club in Mr. Lumley's room 115 today during lunch. Anyone of any skill level is free to join. New and veteran players are welcome. For more information, join their Google Classroom with the code on screen. Just like you can learn something new from these clubs, let's go to Nikita and Alex to learn about a few new teachers from this year. As the beginning of a new school year rolls around, new faces are also introduced to the staff. Ms. Raker, a new teacher this year, talks about what she's excited for. I'm really excited to be here to work with the students and the rigor of the magnet programs here. Another new teacher, Ms. Zamboyan, talks about what interests her in coming to Suncoast. Uh, Suncoast is a school that's very prideful on its academics. And as a student growing up, I was very prideful on my academics as well. So the opportunity to teach high caliber students and high advanced courses appealed to me. This has been Alex and Nikita for WRSN. Before we get into sports, if you are interested in gr the girls basketball team, please come out to conditioning every Tuesday and Thursday from 3.15 to 4.30 on the outside basketball courts. Please make sure all paperwork is completed and, skill and all skill levels are welcome. Now let's turn it over to Man at First Fours. Yeah. 
What's up, Chargers? It's Munnis bringing you sports news for the day. Yesterday, the girls' varsity volleyball team ended their first set 25 to 19, their second set 25 to 16, and their final set 25 to 16. Great job, girls. Both the JV and freshman girls' volleyball teams lost yesterday, but looked to bounce back Tuesday at home against Palm Beach Gardens. The swim team has a meet today at Barracuda Bay at 4 p.m. against Palm Beach Gardens. Good luck today, Chargers. Lastly, the football team will look to continue their momentum from last week's game at home today at 6.30 against Jupiter. We hope to see you all there. That's all for sports today, Chargers. Now, back to Sophia and Nikita in the studio. Thank you, Manit. Now let's wish our Chargers a very happy birthday. Happy birthday, Chargers. Before we end today's show, we want to remind you that math tutoring with Ms. Woodside is canceled for today. Tutoring will resume next week. Remember to check our accompanying slides for more information about today's announcements and extra details that we couldn't fit into the show. That's all for today, Chargers. This has been Nikita and Sophia. 